Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. Today's video is going to be all about my fall favorites from the month of November and probably October as well because I have been using these products for this whole entire time. So without further ado, I'm just going to get straight into the video. So the first thing I'm going to show you guys is just a few beauty things because I literally just have, I just have like two products to show you guys because um, I'm going to get into the fashion and that's going to take up a little bit of time. So the first thing I want to show you guys is this Modern Renaissance Palette by Anastasia Beverly Hills. And I got this as a present on my birthday in September. And I have been using this thing ever since. Every single day, as well as today, I've been using this palette constantly. I love all the colors in this palette, especially like the oranges and the reds. I'm really liking those colors on my eyelids and just like to make up my entire face lately. And the colors are just so fall. They just go with like the fall aesthetic. So I don't have much to say else about this palette, just that it is literally like one of my favorites right now. I keep gravitating towards it. So that's why it has made it to my top favorites. The next thing I wanna show you guys are these nail polishes that I got recently. Um, they're all from OPI and they're literally all just fall aesthetic. And I didn't even mean to do that. I just saw them and I was loving all the colors that they had. So um, I got them. I just grabbed like literally almost all of them. And these are actually from the Scandal line last year. Um, and I actually really, really like Scandal. I love the show. I love Olivia Pope. Um, and all of these colors are literally so pretty for the fall. So I picked them up this year. I don't know if they're available anymore because like I said, these are from last year's line. So I'm not sure if they um, are being sold. I'm pretty sure you can find them on, on Amazon. But the first color I want to show you guys is this really pretty like cranberry red color. Um, and this color is called Popular Vote. And it's so pretty, it's like cranberries. So it's great for like Christmas time and like Thanksgiving. Um, I actually did not wear this for Thanksgiving as wearing another shade, but this would have been perfect. The next color I want to show you guys is similar to the color that I'm wearing on my nails right now, but this is actually not OPI, this is SE, this is Romper Room if anybody was wondering. I did share this in um, some sort of spring video, I'm sure. I don't remember exactly when, but I know that I have talked about this nail polish before. But this nail polish that I'm talking about right now is the, it's called Pale to the Chief. I said that really weird. I was like, Chief, Pale to the Chief. And um, yeah, this is another OPI color. It's just this really pretty nude color. It's almost kind of like on the, on the side of like a very, very light beige. It's so pretty. I haven't put it on my nails yet. I can't wait to see how it looks like on but I really, really like this color. I think this is gonna be one of my staple nail polish colors even after fall because it's just like, it's just a, a universal sort of color. You know, you can wear it in the summer, the spring, the fall, or the winter time. So I really like that color. The next color that I picked up was this Yank My Doodle color. And this one's really pretty. It's kind of like on the orangey side, but it's like, it's kind of like an orangey pinky sort of thing. Um, it's really pretty. If, if I had to describe it, it'd be like a very light brick sort of color. And I have worn this before. It looks gorgeous on um, my nails. And yeah, I just, I really, really like this. The next color that I'm going to show you is really, simi really similar to another one that I have already. So I might return this one because it's literally like almost identical to another color that I have. But this is called Squeaker of the House. And it's just this really nice kind of um, sort of brown, but more on the gray side. So it's like a gray brown sort of color. And it looks really pretty on at least the one that I have. This one I haven't, um, I haven't put on my nails, but the one that I do have that it's like literally similar. I put them together and they literally like look exactly the same. The other one looks really great on my nails. So I might just return this one um, or do it in a give and put it in a giveaway. I'm not sure yet. And the last color that I want to show you guys is definitely one that's much brighter than all the other colors, but I really, really like it. It could also be a summer color, but I don't know, when I put all these colors together in a row, they kind of remind me of like fall uh, leaves. Like probably not here in Florida because we don't have that, but like the generic falling of leaves, you know, when the leaves turn and all that stuff. So this yellow here that's extremely, extremely yellow um, is called the it color and it's literally so pretty i love this color i don't know why i don't know how it's gonna look on my nails i haven't put it on yet but i just really liked it i yeah 
all these are definitely made, making it to my fall favorites video because I just love all these colors. So that's it for the beauty stuff. I'm going to show you guys the home stuff that I have. Actually, I just have one thing that I want to show you guys that I'm just obsessed with. So I'm going to show you that, and that is the Caramel Pumpkin Swirl Candle from Bath & Body Works. I picked this up um, a couple of months ago, and I have been obsessed with it. I don't usually like pumpkin smells, but it smells so delicious. And as you guys know, um, the hot cocoa candle that I'm pretty sure I talked about in... Um, last year's video because I've just been using it like I have I stock up every single year but that's also made it to my favorites but no other candles for this year unfortunately I just have this one that I'm obsessed with right now and rightfully so because it just it smells really good so now I'm moving on to fall fashion favorites and I have a lot of stuff to talk about so I'm just gonna get straight into this topic the first thing I want to show you guys are two pairs of earrings that I have been obsessed with I feel like you guys cannot hear that when I just said that um, the first thing I want to talk about are two earrings that I have been obsessed with lately and the first pair you guys saw in one of my recent um, lookbooks which are these little earrings actually no you guys didn't see these in a lookbook you guys saw these in a recent fall makeup video that I just did these are from J. Crew, and they're literally so cute they're like stud dangle earrings and I'm really obsessed with like stud dramatic um, earrings right now so these ones have made it to my top favorites I love how they're just like this pretty I don't know sort of like brown marble to it and then they have like these little little dangly things on the bottom that kind of remind me of flowers the next pair of earrings I'm going to show you guys are these hoop earrings and these are also stud earrings and these are so cool I've already worn these a couple of times out I can insert some insert some pictures of how I've worn these earrings but I'm obsessed with these earrings I can't I don't remember if I wore these in my recent fall fashion video but I know that I have worn these out and they're literally so cute they're just like one two three four four ring um, gold hoop earrings the next thing I'm going to show you guys is this top that I have worn to and I know for a fact I've worn it in my um, recent fall fashion video and it's this bell sleeve pinstripe loft top and it is so beautiful and the fact that it's white and black pinstripes it means it can go with so many different things so you guys can definitely watch the video if you guys want to see how I paired this item the next thing I'm gonna be talking about is this pink long duster sweater and it has these little pockets right in the front and they're just it's kind of like a just throw over doesn't have any buttons or zippers but this is from forever 21 and it's really really pretty I absolutely love this thing and I've been wearing it so much because it's actually really warm. It keeps me really warm. And I know that Florida doesn't get very cool, but for the days that it does, that thing has been keeping me warm. So I really like it. The next thing I'm going to be talking about are these boots that I got from last year's Christmas. And these are these thigh-high suede, um, kind of like a taupe colored boot with a chunky heel. And these are like pointed toe as well, which I love. I love pointed toe shoes right now. These are from Kenzie, if I'm not mistaken. Let me see. Yeah, these are from Kenzie. And I am obsessed with these. I don't get to wear them um, very often, so that's probably like my least favorite thing about them because it just doesn't get cold. And whenever you're just like out wearing boots in like 70 degree weather or like 60 degree weather, you kind of look ridiculous because it's really not that cold. It's not necessary to wear boots. But I try to wear these as much as I can if I like just like with anything, if it's like even the tiniest little bit cold because I want to get the use out of it because I got them literally last year um, for Christmas and then it wasn't cold. It wasn't cold at Christmas or anything so I didn't get to wear them. I think I only got to wear them like once last year and not, no, that was technically this year because it was in February that I wore these to like the movies and I just wore them like really really quickly because it was like kind of chilly night and I was like ooh gonna wear these and I wore them with like a romper but and these are definitely one of my fall favorites. I love these. I just wish that I could get a little bit more use out of them but I'm pretty sure if I go up north like sometime maybe next year or something like that i can maybe wear them again next thing i'm going to be talking about is this white house black market crescent necklace that i'm wearing right now it's so pretty i definitely i, I didn't get this in in like the fall time i got this like a couple months i probably got this in like summertime so 
this thing is so versatile i've been wearing it like all summer and i've been wearing it all um fall and i'm probably gonna keep wearing it in the winter and roll it on and into springtime it's so versatile i really really like it it's like gold and it has these little rhinestones on at the top of the the crescent and it's just like so dainty and small and you can layer it so i really really like this necklace the last thing I'm going to be talking about is this recent purchase that I got, which is this top that I'm actually wearing right now from Forever 21. And it's this really, really pretty um, like chiffon material. It has these sleeves that are so like retro. They kind of remind me of like Renaissance period or something like that. Like they're so, um, it's so vintage looking. And I have on the top, there's like this really high collar and it's kind of like a baby doll sort of um, collar. And it has like all this stuff going on so i'm just really into like dramatic shirts right now and like dramatic sleeves so thank you guys for watching this video i hope you guys enjoyed this video if you did like this video definitely remember to give this video a thumbs up and if you haven't been subscribed to my videos already definitely subscribe and turn on that little bell so that you can know when a new video will be dropping soon I do want to let you guys know that I am doing Vlogmas this year. I do Vlogmas a little bit different than everybody else because I don't do like daily videos. I do weekly videos. So I just take videos every single day and then I compile them into a week's worth of video and then I go ahead and I put that video out. So I do uh, Vlogmas week one, Vlogmas week two, and three. So I will be doing that. I have started recording for that. I am going to be editing my first Vlogmas video. Um, and that will be going out really really soon. I'm pretty sure this video is going to be going out first and then you guys are going to be seeing the vlogmas video. But I hope you guys enjoyed this video. I'll see you soon. Bye bye.